This video is not financial advice. I'm not a financial planner. I'm an entertainer. <laughs> the one, the only eight baller on the throne. Wow! So, I don't know if you watched the last video I made. I ate like 10 strawberries. Um, it just, it just hit home. Like all that food that's sitting in my stomach. I don't know, like strawberries, I guess, are a laxative. I felt it, man. I was like, I ran to the, ran to the bathroom. <laughs> I was like, that's it. Time for release. It's like I had the big, uh, Callahan, the prime rib, mashed potatoes, mushrooms, asparagus, cream spinach. I mean, just a lot of food tonight. A lot of food, coconut shrimp, tons of bread with butter. When I, when I ate those strawberries, that's it. That was like, uh, you know, time to rock and roll, baby, on the bowl. So as I'm on the bowl, I saw uh, Top uh, Ticker Trades commented on one of my videos saying he made a video about me. And um, I said, I'll check it out. And here's my reply to his video. I don't know if this guy is like just like, you know, mentally like off or if he's taking some sort of sub substance. You know, I'm, I'm, again, I, I, I'm not making any you know, allegations because I have no idea if, whether the guy is taking some kind of drugs or, you know, whether it be, you know, cocaine, crack. I don't, I'm not sure what's wrong with this guy. Maybe he's just a, an alcoholic. I don't know. Because, he, first of all, the guy talks like he's mentally retarded. I don't know if you know this. Like, he just talks like there's something off. You know when you hear someone's voice and you can just tell there is something. Like, the guy's not playing with a 52 deck of cards. Everything that he keeps saying about me are lies. Like he said to me, I made a video where I sold my AMC in the past. That, that never happened. I never sold my AMC and I never said that I was going to sell my AMC. So that's number one. Then number two, the guy can't differentiate between an April Fool's joke. It was April 1st. I put out a video that my wife left me. She took the dog. She took the, my minivan, the kids. She took... Uh, uh, you know, maybe that's where he's getting it from. The guy can't differentiate between an April Fool's joke and something that's serious. Because, uh, you know, obviously we're talking about an April uh, Fool's joke. My wife took all my money. She took the kids. She took the dogs. I made a video saying, you know, April Fool's Day. And I told everybody it was all a joke. But this guy actually thinks it's serious. He, he, he made like a very serious video saying like, can you believe it, man? The ape wife took all his money took his AMC, took, you know, his kids, his dogs, she, she took the minivan. So, you know, right off the bat, you know that this guy's uh, off his rock. <laughs> he can't differentiate between an April Fool's joke and what's real. And then all these other things that, that he's just like he's saying. It's like, it's just, I don't know what else. I, I can't really listen to him too long because I kind of feel like my intellect, my IQ getting lower listening to this guy because this guy's like, meant, I'm, I'm not... Even joking around, there's just something mentally wrong with him. And again, I don't know. Maybe as a kid, you know, he fell on his head. I have no idea. Ran into a tree. I don't know. But there's just something, unfortunately, off with this guy mentally. Guy calls me a pedophile in his last video. You know, they asked him, do you have evidence on this? He's like, I don't know. I heard it somewhere. I mean, you know. I mean, how do you call somebody the lowest form of like, you know, scum on earth? You have like no evidence. I just think the guy, look, here's another thing. He's making fun of me. He's like that I have uh, one of my videos, 96 views. The guy doesn't understand, first of all, that YouTube is shadow banning my, my channel. Okay. So I'm not even going to continue to prove it. It's a fact. It is a fact. Because when I first started, let's just sum it up in June, I was getting 50 to 100,000 views every video. Then it went down, you know, 4,000, 5,000 views. Then it went down to like a uh, thousand, two thousand views, and now it's down to like you know, some cases he's right, as low as a couple of uh, could be fifty views, a hundred views. But this is the thing that he's not understanding: you can't base okay something from one video. You have to look at the total amount of views that I have accumulated. So I've accumulated well over three point five million views. Okay. You've accumulated just a little bit over 1.5 million views. Even though you might have a little bit more subs, I think he's got 12,200 subs and I got like 10,800. 
I have over 2 million more views than you. So you're not really in a position to make fun of me with views because you got to catch up to me. Okay, you're broccoli in this in this eat movement. You understand? I'm a, like, I'm on the top of the food chain. You understand? I am what's called a porterhouse steak. I'm the king. You understand? I'm the king of the jungle. All right. You are just broccoli. You, you you're so weak that you can I can't even make you a meat. Like I can't call you a chicken. I can't call you a brajol. I can't call you a meatball. You don't deserve those titles. You're a broccoli. <laughs> okay. So that's basically. I mean, I kind of feel sorry for the guy that he actually thinks that my April Fool's jokes are real. Okay, then he's talking about Amy, you know, is uh, still referring to AMC. One of my eight brothers sent me a message saying that there was a movie, you know, I, I saw it before, you know, Congo, where the monkey, there's a monkey in the movie, and her name is Amy. So is that the reference to AMC? Because that's what my eight brother, he sent me a message trying to explain to me. Because, you know, I don't know what else it could be because Amy is A M E, A me, right? You know what I mean? So beats beats me. But anyway, um, the eight father is holding thirty four hundred shares strong of AMC. I did get a little uh, off my rocker the last couple of days with all the construction, uh, the corruption. It's like almost four o'clock in the morning. You gotta you gotta forgive me. I've been out all day taking care of everybody. My eight mother. The ape wife, the ape dogs, the ape kids. I'm starting to get tired. <laughs> just wanted to make a quick video. So look, you got to just, you got to analyze the source of this guy, okay? Number one, the fact that he called me a pedophile. Right off the bat, all his credibility is gone. He has no evidence. He's just talking garbage for views and for subs in the, in the cloud chase. That's number one. So calling me a pedophile, all your, your corruption is flood. All of your corruption. You see how tired I'm getting? I feel like I got to get some sleep. All of your, okay, lies are going to be flushed out the toilet. Listen, just like this. Just like that. Because it's like, how, how, how dare you call me a pedophile when I'm the, one of the greatest fathers? I, I do everything for my children. I love them with all my heart and soul. You're calling me a pedophile. Guy's nuts. The guy, guy's telling that I sold uh, AMC. Show me the video where I said, are you referring to the April Fool's video? Guy really believes that my wife took my kids away from me took my minivan, took all my money, all my AMC. You got it. I, I kind of feel bad for the guy. I really do. But you know what? You're on the team, right? You're buying AMC. So I guess, you know, we're eight brothers. <laughs> Whether you like it or not, we're on the same team. But you really got to try to like, look at like things from the perspective of reality and not fantasy. And everything you just said in your last video was fantasy. Not, not one single comment that you said was real. Everything was all lies. You know, I could do the same thing to you. Like, how would you like it if I called you a pedophile, okay? But I don't joke about things like that. You know why, you know why I'm not going to come back and do something like that? Because I believe there were many children who had the most hor horrific experiences. And they, they are really the victims of pedophiles. And let me tell you something, man. You got to bring all of those pedophiles. You got to put them in prison. You got to lock them up. You got to give them the death penalty. They don't belong on this planet Earth with us. So I'm not going to like resort to call him that because, you know, I don't I don't do things like that. I take matters like that very seriously. But this doofus, this bozo, this mama loop, this coconut that looks like Brad Pitt from the movie California. You understand? Complete white trash bum. That's all he is. Probably lives in a trailer park. You know what I mean? The guy is, you feel, I feel, I feel sorry for him. I really, I really feel sorry for this guy. But here are the facts, Jack. Okay. I got over 3.5 million views. You got 1.5. I beat you. I have over 2 million. Okay. Views. Okay. Number two, I am not selling my AMC, but I am buying GameStop. I'm buying both. I'm buying AMC and GameStop. Okay. Number three, you know, you're saying that I'm a pedophile. You have no evidence. That makes you the biggest, you talk about douchebags, that makes you the biggest douchebag that has ever lived on this planet. You should you should go to church, you should get holy water, and you should, you know, I don't know if you're a Catholic. I'm a Catholic, as you can see. But you should really, like, just ask for forgiveness from God because let me tell you something, man. 
That is just horrible calling someone that a pedophile. It's, and, and, and I honestly can't believe that there are people that actually take this guy seriously. Like, I at least admit to you I'm an entertainer, but this guy's trying to convince you all these things are real. And you know what? You're, you're actually a dumber person and a stupid person if you could believe that. You, you understand? You, I see people commenting, you know, oh my God, is this real? Is this true? Where's your evidence? Listen to me. He doesn't have evidence. It's not true. I'm not a pedophile, you psychopathic lunatics on YouTube. Okay, so just tell this guy, I don't even know if I could even do any more like like uh, videos on him. I, I just hope he goes away. He's probably not going to. He's just going to keep making video after video after video about me because he wants to be me, because he looks up to me. Oh, there's another thing. He says I subscribe to him. I never subscribe to him. It's all lies. Tell him to prove it. Let me, like, you know, you can go through your subscriptions. Show it where the ape father is a, is a sub, uh, subscriber of you. I have never subscribed to you. I never even know who you were until you mentioned my name. I had no idea who you were. I didn't know you existed. So that's all I have to say. Uh, just about finished releasing myself. This is what I think of you, my friend. You see this? Okay? This is what I think of you. I think that about says all my feelings. Eight fall out.